Hi friends, I'm Rebecca, welcome. This is a 15 minute yoga flow and we will be doing some movement in the series with pranayama. I think of it as my ancestral flow. So really to get that energy moving with the breath and the movement, okay? So come to a seated position, roll the heads of your shoulders back, set your intention for your practice. What is it that you want to cultivate in your practice? Now, right from here, we're gonna go into the breath work. So from here, you can stay seated this way. You're gonna inhale, reach the arms up, exhale and take it down. Inhale, lift up, exhale, take it down. Okay, so that's the first option. Next option is here. Inhale, lift up, exhale, take it down. Inhale. Exhale, next option, inhale, lift, exhale, and lower. Inhale, follow the breath, jai breath, feel that contraction in the back of your throat. Inhale, lift, exhale, lower. Get that breath moving, inhale, exhale, and lower. Again, inhale, lift up, exhale, and lower. Inhale, and exhale, good. Come on forward onto your hands and knees. Continue with that breath work. So inhale, come into a back bend. Exhale and round. Inhale into your back bend. Exhale and round. Now come on into a high plank. Take your legs back. Press back downward facing dog. Now let's do that again. Inhale, come forward into a high plank. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, forward into your high plank, lower your knees, your chest, and your chin. Inhale, come into a low cobra, bhujangasana. Push your pubic bone in towards the earth, open through the heart, and then lift your left hand, lift your right hand, hover here, and try to keep the neck in line with the rest of your spine. Lower yourself into the earth, wiggle out your hips, Take your arms behind you, squeeze your palms into a fist, embed the pubic bone down, inhale, lift the heart. Exhale, lower down. Take the hands down into the earth, press the toes under, and then push back into a high plank, downward facing dog, Adho Mukha Shavasana. Now you're going to look forward between your hands, take the right leg up into the sky, step it all the way through between your hands, then you're going to drop the back knee. Inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, take the hands down. Inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, take the hands down. Now straighten out the front leg. Flex the foot. Inhale, get long through the spine. And exhale, full here. Inhale. Exhale. And that's in with your breath. Slowly walk that front foot forward, tuck the toes of the back foot, pivot over to the other side of your mat. Okay, we're gonna take the left leg up into the sky, reach it all the way up, and then step it all the way through, back knee drops down, untuck the toes. Sweep the arms up into the sky, inhale. Follow the breath, exhale. Inhale, lift, exhale, lower. Inhale, lift, exhale, lower. Now inhale, lift up, hold up, take the hands down. Exhale, take the hands down. Now straighten out the front leg, hold here. Slowly walk that front foot forward, tuck the toes of the back foot, bring the right leg forward. And yes and no. Okay, so we're opening our feet up, bend the knees, toes are a little internally rotated, and then gently rock it out from side to side.
Now let's get that breath moving again. Drop the hands down into the earth. Inhale, look up and lengthen through the spine. Now you can use your blocks here if you prefer. Exhale and bow. Again, inhale, lengthen, bend your knees and stick your tailbone out. Exhale, bow. Inhale, Ujjayi Pranayama. Exhale, bow. Now, if you want to, you're going to add the arms into this. So, when you bow, you bend your knees. Inhale, get long. Exhale, bow. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bow. Inhale, get long. Exhale, bow. Connect in with the breath. Inhale, get long. Exhale, bow. Now, stay here and gently swing from side to side. Get into that back and the spine. Maybe let out a moan if that feels like you should. And then let's go ahead and pivot over to this side of our mat. Take your hands into the earth. Push into your high plank. Then from a high plank, push back into downward facing dog, Adho Mukha Shavasana. Okay, we're moving forward into our high plank again. Take the right knee towards your right tricep and then take it back down with facing dog. Now take that right knee towards your belly, step it forward, drop the back knee again, untuck the toes. Then inhale, send the arms up into the sky. Now stay with this or lift the back leg up. Okay, and then what I want you to do is bend the knee, drop the tailbone down and straighten through that back leg. With that, reach up through the left arm and take a twist, okay? Take your hand to the outside, make a fist, elbow, take your elbow to the outside of that front thigh and then push your hand on top, lift the heart up. Now keep this twist, look down towards your feet, step that back foot forward, stay in your twist and look up. And then drop down in towards the earth. Shake your head yes and no. And again, yes and no. Okay, take your hands down into the earth. Step back, high plank, lower knees, chest and chin. Inhale, slither through. Exhale, lower down. Push your hands into the earth, tuck your toes, high plank, a downward facing dog. Okay, so let's do the left side. Take the left leg up into the sky, bring the knee forward onto your tricep, and then pull it back up. Then bring it forward towards your nose, step into it. Drop the back knee, untuck the toes, inhale, lift up. Stay here, tuck the toes of the back foot. Drop the tailbone down, send it down into the earth, pull the navel in towards your spine, and then slowly start to straighten through that back leg. Get long through your right side body, inhale, exhale, twist. Okay, let's keep the twist, look down towards the left foot, bring the right leg forward, Come back into your twist here. And then bow down in towards the earth. Shake your head out. Inhale, lift up halfway. Exhale, bow. Inhale, come all the way up to stand. Reach your arms up. Reach for the sky. Exhale, hands come through to your heart center. Okay, now pause here while you're standing. Okay, so now you're going to take your right leg, if you're marrying me, cross it over your left. Bring your hands to your heart. Option one. Option two, we're going to slowly start to pull at the hip and bend the knee. Stay with the breath. Now, if you choose to, you take your hands down into the earth. That's another variation. Another variation, you're going to come on over to the left side of your mat. Bend your elbows 
and then balance here. Inhale, exhale. Stay with the breath. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Then drop the foot down. Come back through to center. Step that foot down. Rock your hips from side to side. Let go of your head. Let go of the neck. And then we'll do the other side, okay? So round through the spine. Come all the way back up to stand. You're going to stand on your right leg. Cross your left leg over. Stay here. Hands to the heart. Then fold at the knee joint. Fold, fold at the hip. Next option, take your hands down. Stay with this. Next option, twist. And then again, if you choose to, bend your elbows and lift that back foot up. And just take about three breaths. Release that, bring the foot down, and then drop your head, shake your head out. Yes and no. We're gonna take our right hand, bring it across right above the ankle, look underneath your armpit, reach your left arm up into the sky. Now squeeze your thigh muscles upward. Let your head dangle and then just twist. Now release. Change sides. We grab on. Look through. Reach your right arm up into the sky. Twist. And release. Okay. Let's come on down into a squat, Malasana. Then from Malasana, let's move into our boat pose and then final relaxation. So stay with your boat pose right here. Okay, your knees are bent in this variation. You're welcome to extend them if you prefer, but it's your choice. Stay here and then lower yourself down. Oh, doesn't that feel good? Inhale, exhale, come on up. Inhale, feel the breath. Exhale, come on up. Inhale. Exhale. Now stay with the next exhalation. Stretch it out. Inhale, come on down. Exhale, keep exhaling. Inhale, float yourself down. Let out a nice big sigh. And then float into your final relaxation. Okay, deepen your breath, wiggle your fingers, your toes, stretch open your jaw. Then roll over to one side into a little ball. Push yourself up to a seated position. Now you're welcome to stay on your back and end your practice there if you'd like. Or if you want to, you can come into a seated position, tune back into that intention. Think about what it is you want to cultivate in your life. 
Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Namaste.